How y'all doing today? Yeah, so what I got is I got a launch trailer for you. It's the one for Inspector Gadget Mad Time Party. Launch trailer, Smart Tail Games. Whew. <laughs> yeah, you might remember that I did the teaser trailer for this one. And I wasn't and I said maybe you might want to make it a little bit longer than this. Well, I think maybe microids or however you pronounce it took our words to heart and I guess probably made a longer trailer. And by the way, the game comes out today. So if you're thinking about picking up this game and you like and you like a bunch of mini games and you also you know like inspect a gadget, it might be a good idea might be a good idea a good idea to pick up this game and see if it's to your liking. Now I guess with no further delay, let's go ahead and get this and get this underway. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one. Here we go. Nice. Gadget, the situation is. Wait. That sounds nothing like. Maurice LaMarche, who I think voiced Chief Quimby in most of the most of the original series. Serious, the city is in the hands of man. <laughs> and that doesn't sound anything like Frank Walker either. Uh, uh, wowzers! Right away, Chief. Right again. Don't worry, Chief. I'm always on duty, and I'm right, and I'm on the case. Oh my. He makes his return. We believe the only way to stop this is to use Professor von Slickstein's time machine. Wait, wait. If I remember right, didn't they use that like only three times in the original series? First time was to go back to the to his great grandfather, great grandfather gadget, who was a caveman, if I remember correctly. Second time was to ancient Rome, or Rome, I think is how they said it. And the third and final time, if I remember right, it was to go back to 19th century London to visit with his grandparents, I think he said. I think he said, so if that's the case... Wouldn't that be gadgets a lot older than he than he appears to be? And wait, if I remember correctly, and I could be remembering this wrong, guys. I could be remembering this wrong. So, so if I get this wrong, please someone correct me. If I got this wrong, please. I'm begging you guys. If I got this wrong, here's what I think Professor von Slickstein said. Did didn't he say that it was that he re that he rebuilt the HG Wells time machine in the first episode they, where they used it? And wait, here's something else I figured out too. In the first episode where they used it, which I think was called Tyrannosaurus Gadget, I think I I could be wrong on that. I could be wrong. Could be wrong. Anyway. <clears throat> If I remember right, they didn't have a set time limit, yet it yet in the two other episodes where they used it, they had like four hours to get back to to get for Gadget to get his assignment done and get back to the time machine so they could get back home. Whew. You see this big red button? You really Oh boy. Gadget, why did you push that button? Seriously, why did you, dude? I mean, seriously. You broke it. Great. You broke the darn thing. Of course it is. This time he brings company. It looks like he brings a pirate ancestor. His first ancestor, I think. A cowboy ancestor and a Viking ancestor. I guess. Hmm. 
thing. The machine threw Gadget's ancestors out of time. <laughs> yep. Wow. Yes. Doesn't look too bad, guys. Doesn't look too bad. Looks like looks like you have to do mini games in order to repair the time machine with an array of mini games, as I pretty much figured. Well done, Uncle Gadget. Wait. That penny didn't sound anything like Free Summer, did she? No. And wait, in this in this little in, in this little part of the video, they look like they're in a museum or something. I guess. Wait, isn't that the ancestor from like nineteenth century London? So it looks like in this one you get gadget his. Ancestor from, like, the Wild West or something? Great Grandfather Gadget? And I think that's his ancestor from 19th century London. Can't remember which one it is. Either It's either Char or Chimney Gadget. I think that was the name. I think. I could be wrong, though. Could be wrong, guys. So if I got that wrong, and, you know... Listen, if I got any of this wrong, do feel free to let me know, okay? Well, let's hope you can stop Mad's evil plans. Let's go. Oh, boy. Oh, it's like if you... Yeah, look, if, you, if you're available now, as you can see, launch bonuses, you get the game, you get two sticker sheets... You get a poster. That's cool. That's awesome, you guys. So, what'd you guys think of that, huh? If you guys like, if you guys did enjoy the video, and I hope you did, <laughs> there's a few things I'd like you guys to do for me. Okay? You guys pretty much know what they are, and that would be to give a like. Share your thoughts as in, a com in the comments down below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And if you have, I do appreciate it. Um, click that bell to be notified for future videos. Uh, let's see. What else? What else? What else? Oh, yeah. And uh, share the video around if you, if you feel so obliged to do so. That's your right to do so. I'm not forcing you guys to do it. You're right. Yeah, and it looks and it looks like with the sticker set you get all the gadget ancestors, brain, uh I can't really tell who that is. Unless that's Dr. Claus sitting by his chair. And that obviously is. And this poster, by the way, if you if you ask me, looks freaking sweet. It'd be sweet to hang it up on a you know on a wall somewhere. <laughs> of course, to put it in a, in a to find a frame that find a frame big enough to hold that thing would be practically you know practically probably impossible to find one. So yeah, so if you guys did enjoy that, and I hope you did, you know. You guys have yourselves a great day. You have a good time. And for those of you who have already picked up the game, that's awesome. And for those of you who haven't yet, that's cool too. That's all right. That's okay. So, you guys have a good day. You guys be good. You guys be awesome. You guys take care of yourselves. And guys, have a good time. And let's try to enjoy, let's try to enjoy this time of the year, okay? <laughs> because as you know, summer is winding down. Yes, I know September is a fall month. I know that. And guys, you guys have a good time. You have a good day. Be good. Behave. And guys, till next time. Later, fam squad.